What is going on guys, today I'm going to show you all the bug locations from common, uncommon, rare, epic, legendary, mythic, just kidding, there's no legendary mythic, but I'm going to show you all the rarities and all the locations of the bugs. If you came here to find a rare and epic, you can go ahead and just skip to the times here. So we're just going to start by ants. So basically ants are kind of found anywhere where there's tables and stuff, there's one right here. Anywhere there's tables you can find ants. Same with mites, you can find them all over the ground, just randomly. Look, there's one right there. And little little black dots, it's not like too hard to find. Then flies usually hang around trash, like here. There's a lot around sewers and stuff. The yellow butterflies, they kind of just fly around wherever. There's usually some around here, some all around plaza. They fly all around downtown, it's kind of just in any open area really. Now snails usually just stay around water, there's one right here. Bumblebees usually just hang around flowers, there's flowers here. Basically anywhere there's flowers, that's where the bees will be. Moths will all be basically where anywhere street lights are, so these street lights right here. Mosquitoes basically just hang around water as well. There's usually some right here by this bike. You see one right there? And he stung me. Jumping spiders kinda just go around the area too. They're usually just around here. Just kinda around open areas. Silk moths spawn right here, right here, and then some over there. The dung beetle will spawn around here. Fireflies kind of spawn around trees. Midman cicadas spawn on trees. Horse cicadas spawn on trees, and large brown cicadas spawn on trees. All the grasshoppers, all three of the types, they all just spawn around camp, they spawn around downtown, they kind of just spawn all out in the open as well. Ladybugs spawn on trees as you can see right here. And rhino beetles can spawn around these trees right here. And basically all these trees along this line, the rhino beetle can spawn on. It can even spawn over on these two trees. The best place to catch all the butterflies is literally in hometown. This is where the cabbage butterflies go, and then this is where the peacock butterflies go. Skimmers can spawn around in hometown as well. They kind of just spawn all around here down the roads. They can spawn around here, and they can spawn over here in this football field. And if you go behind the football field around over here, they can also spawn over here. Stag beetles can spawn on these kind of trees too. They kind of just spawn all around. They basically just spawn on all these trees kind of just scattered everywhere. The maple moth kind of just spawns down here around all these street lights. Basically just gotta check down this route. Also in all the street lights in hometown as well. Emperor dragonflies kind of spawn around here as well. Same as skimmer locations that I showed. They can spawn over here. They kind of spawn around camp as well. The Lucanus and the metallic stag beetles, they can spawn upon these trees right here. They can also spawn on this tree in front of the fire department. They also spawn on this tree. And these trees as well. Centipedes actually spawn in here. Which is one right now, and I need it. So the centipedes basically just spawn all around this little area right here. They can spawn back here as well. They also kind of spawn in this walkway right here, and they can even spawn around right here. Now the Jumbo Dragonfly and the beautiful Dragonfly thingy-majigger, my bobber, they can spawn right here as well. They also can spawn right here too. Over here by this gas station in the hotel, they can spawn back here as well. A lot of bugs spawn back here. So the Praying Mantis can actually spawn around this area. He can spawn around here. He can spawn right here. And he can even spawn around over here. Basically just any open fields. He can even spawn right here in the road. He can spawn over here. And he can spawn over here by this gas station over here. Now the morph butterfly can spawn over here. He can spawn right here. And then he can spawn up here. Top of the camp. Now these two beetles basically just spawn around here in these trees. Then they can also spawn on these trees over here. 
And as for the golden stag beetle, it's only in camp, so it spawns around on these trees. You can spawn over here on these. But I feel like the most frequent spot, it'll spawn over on these trees. The thing is, when you're catching epics, you gotta like, you gotta walk this speed. You gotta do your tippy tippy toes. Zero 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 point one miles per hour is what you have to go. And for this beetle, he spawns on these trees, the same as the rhino beetles. Just these trees all along this way right here. That's where he can spawn. And then on these trees over here. The Alexander butterfly spawns around here. He'll spawn over here. And then he can even spawn down these roads right here. It's basically just kind of search all around town. So for the Hercules beetle over here by the football field, it can actually spawn on this one tree right here. It can spawn on this other tree. And then if you go over here, it can spawn on these three trees. Or these two over here. Well that pretty much sums up all the buggy buggy buggers. Hope this video helped you guys out for the, some of the locations you didn't know of. I know most of you know where the commons are, but not everyone knows where the epics are located. Make sure to subscribe, click that like button, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. <laughs>